Welcome to Map TV. Please do subscribe to our channel for more videos. Click on the bell button for notification. Welcome back from the break, and this is still the note. I'm just here talking about politics, and I'm enjoy I actually enjoy what I'm doing. Yes, um, about the debate that is going to happen on the February 19th, 2019. Few days from now, the main debate will take place. And a lot of people have been asking me questions through the comment section and um, through my email. They've been contacting, even some on WhatsApp, they've been contacting Mob TV. And they've been saying, asking questions about the beat. I want to answer them right now, to the best of my knowledge. When they initiated the debate, they did an internet pool or internet voting to determine the people. Or the top politician, the top candidates that will be on the debate list. And APC came first, PDP came second, AAC, that is Show Race Party, came third. Automatically, that list was squashed. The pool was taken out of the way, not. The pool never, the internet pool never became a determining factor. They went to another form of selection, which is not known to the public. And they now tell us that Showeri is out of the way, PDP, APC, Kaysley, Mogalo, and I think two other people. Showeri is out, out of the way, OBS are questioning out of the way. Yes, OBS are questioning. Oh, great woman. I'll talk about you very soon. Just don't worry, okay? I'm coming to you. Yes, about the debate. Why do you think Showeri was excluded? Because I think Showeri is this person who is going to be very gutsy and... Who is going to tell them their mind, his mind, even if it does not win? But during the debate, to create a platform for him to be very, very vocal and verbal. They don't want that. They don't want the truth. That's the reason why history has been expunged from Nigerian curriculum. If you don't know, check the Nigerian educational curriculum. History is out of the way. Because they don't even want us to know where we're coming from. What a government. Yes, Shore debate, it, uh, uh, APC. PDP. Now, there is a rumor that Mr. President will not show up for the debate. Hello, because it's actually, according to rumor, that he will get sick on that day. <laughs> Nigeria, my great country. You know, when a girl does not want to visit you in Nigeria, he will tell you, say, what about next week Thursday? Thursday? Are you going to come and say, no, by next week Thursday, I'll be having a headache. So, they already know that Mr. President will not be well on the 16th, or on the 19th of January, um, the debate for, the main debate for the president, the presidential candidate, or presidential election. I don't know. What do you think? The comment section is there for you to air your view and waiting to respond to it. 19th February, we're expectant. I know you're expectant to, you want to know what is happening, how the debate is going to turn out, and who is going to win, and who is going to lose out of it. I am still expecting to see that. And Shore is in court in that regard and in that respect. Do you think the court will listen to him? Do you think the court of Nigeria will give him verdict and include him in the list and list him? Uh, if that happens, it's a miracle because we know this country where if you go to the court, no, you're your own. You're your own, definitely. But let's say it goes, let's say it goes and let's say it turns out and I still remain, do not, don't go nowhere. Bye for now. Please do subscribe to this channel. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Share this video to others. Maybe let's sensitize their brains and, you know, get Nigeria working again. We all need to come together and get involved in national issues and contribute. It's our country. We need to get affected. Thank you. Bye-bye.